choreographed by Nick Keys and Rick Dominguez. It is a 32 count four wall beginner improver level line dance with no tags and no restarts. I'm gonna turn around and break down the dance section by section using steps and counts. We'll then practice the front wall all the way through with steps and counts before going around and doing a full rotation or four walls of the dance so that you know how it all flows and you can hopefully dance this on the dance floor near you. So let's turn around and learn. Crash and burn, ooh ah. Section one, your weight's going to start on your left foot. We're gonna do steps that are similar to a modified K step. So we're gonna step our right foot forward into the right diagonal, touch your left foot next to your right. You're gonna now step your left foot back into the left back diagonal, and you're gonna slide your right toe into your left. We're now gonna step our right foot back into the right diagonal, touch your left next to your right, you're now gonna step your left foot forward into the left forward diagonal and slide your right toe into your left. So let's try that with some counts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Section two, we're gonna step our right foot to the right side. You're now gonna bend both knees slightly. We're going to do a body roll towards the left. So you're gonna start with your shoulders. You're gonna have them come forward slightly then your chest, then your stomach, and then your hips, and then you're going to sit and hitch. We're now going to step down with our left. This is gonna have straight legs. After your hitch, you straighten your knees. Now we're going to step our left foot to the side, bend both knees, and we're going to start a quarter turn. So we're gonna do a body roll that's going to make about an eighth of a turn. Same thing we did the other way, but this way to the right. Now we're gonna roll those shoulders forward, your chest, your stomach, then your hips and sit, and you should be facing about 130 at this point. You're gonna finish your quarter turn by making an eighth of a turn, hitching your right knee up. So let's try that with some counts. Weights on your left foot, we would have just slid our right foot into our left. You're stepping that right foot to the side. One, two, three, hitch, four, five, six, seven, eight. You're gonna end section two facing three o'clock with your weight on your left foot. Section three, we're gonna do a syncopated vine to the right. So we're gonna step our right foot to the side, left foot behind. We're gonna quickly step our right foot to the right side, cross your left over your right, step your right foot to the right side. We're now gonna step back with our left and we're gonna hitch our right knee up, but you want it to do kind of like a rotating hitch, so you're hitching it up, but it's coming slightly back. Then you're gonna step back with your right and hitch your left knee up. So let's try that with some counts. We just hitched our right knee, we made that quarter turn. Weights on your left foot, we're stepping to the side. One, two, and three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Section four, we're going to repeat that syncopated vine, but to the left. So we're gonna step our left foot to the side, right foot behind, quickly step your left foot to the left side, cross your right over your left, step your left foot to the left side. You're now gonna take your right foot, rock it back behind your left, recover forward onto your left foot. I want you to use this as a prep. So you're opening your body up towards the right and we're going to go into a full turn. So we're prepped back, you're gonna recover onto your left foot and you're doing a half turn over your left shoulder, stepping back with your right, and a half turn over your left shoulder, stepping forward with your left, and then you're ready to start the dance all over again. So let's try that with some counts. We would have just hitched our left knee up. You're stepping to the side. One, two, and three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that is the end of the dance. So now let's face the front. We're going to do it all the way through, one time with steps, one time with counts. Weights on your left foot, you're doing your diagonal step touch. Right diagonal step, touch left, back slide, touch. Diagonal back, touch left, slide and touch. Step, squat, roll and hitch. Step, squat, eighth, roll, eighth, hitch. Side, behind, ball, cross. Side, step, back, hitch, back, hitch. Side, behind, ball, cross. Side, rock, back, recover, half, half. If you wanna make the dance easier, you wanna leave out turns, you can change that half half to two walks forward and you don't have to turn for this dance. Let's try it with some counts. Weight is on your left foot, you're doing your step touch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then you're ready to start all over with your step touch. So now let's go around. We're going to do four walls of the dance on the front and back walls. I'm going to do steps. Side walls will do counts. Weight's going to start on your left foot. You're starting with your diagonal forward touch. So we're going diagonal step, touch back, slide, touch back, diagonal, touch, slide, touch, step, squat, roll, hitch, step, squat, qu quarter roll, hitch, side behind ball cross, side back hitch, back hitch, side behind ball cross, side rock back, recover, half, half, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, and three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, and three, four, five, six, seven, eight, diagonal, touch, back, slide, back, diagonal, touch, step, slide, side, squat, roll, hitch, side, squat, quarter, roll, hitch, side, behind, ball, cross, side, back, hitch, back, hitch, side, behind, ball, cross, side, rock, back, half, half, step, touch, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, and three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, and three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that is the whole dance. I hope this helps you learn crash and burn. Ooh, uh, it's one of my favorites. So I hope it becomes one of yours. If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks guys.